Hello everybody, it's Steve, also known as Not Udon, here to talk about more shoes I just happened to win today. So today, I was very fortunate and I won the right to be able to purchase, not free, but purchase, the Hyper Royal Jordan 1. So I went to um, the, Dubai, the Dubai Mall here in Dubai and I, from the Jordan store, was able to pick up these lovely shoes, the Hyper Royal Jordan 1s. Um, not much to say about them that you don't already know. They're a great looking shoe in person. The kind of suede upper on the top portion is a really nice texture, really nice feel. Has a really nice smell to it also. And then the normal leather as well is nice. And that's my one comment I'll talk about is the leather on the shoe, as Toby's telling you behind us here, is the um, leather is good quality, but compared to the um, University Blues that came out a month ago, there's definitely a difference. I think the University Blue is a much better quality leather in the shoe, but this is still a really nice shoe. Very happy I got this. Um, great looking shoe, just you know, classic, beautiful, just a really nice looking shoe. But comparing it to the leather on the Universities, there's a difference. You can see there's more of a tumbled leather on the University pair, uh, much, I think a higher quality leather. I don't even know if the other ones, I don't know if it's vegan leather on the other ones. I'd be great if it is, but. Um, but the university is just the leather itself is a higher quality. So if I were to compare the two shoes, I would say that the yeah. university blues are a, probably a better quality than the hyper, but the hyper royals are still a wonderful shoe. Very, very worth picking up. Great looking shoe in person. Can't wait to lace them up and wear them. I haven't laced them yet. I just literally got them home and I'm just um, showing them to you now. But that brings up the question is university blue, hyper royal blue, but you also had the Nike SB, Jordan 1 UNC Air Costins also. So that's another shoe in a similar color, color family here. But again, the leather on that one is not as nice as, as on the up on the other ones, but this one is probably very similar leather to the one that's in the Hyper Royal. Very similar quality as far as that goes. So these are very similar, I think, as far as the quality of the leather and quality workmanship. But again, the Air Costin Low Jordan 1 UNC pack was an, another great shoe I got. I actually got them this year. I know they came out um, over a year ago, but the, um, the Frame Skate Shop here, our local skate shop for um, the Middle East, got these in a little bit later than usual, and they released them this year, and I was able to pick up a pair, pick up a pair, which I'm very happy with. So this is the Nike SB Jordan 1. So in conclusion, all three are amazing. Very happy I was able to get all three pairs over the course of the last few months. Um, if you have a chance to pick them up, I highly recommend it, though it's probably unlikely at this point to be able to come across these without playing resale. The Hyper Royal, I think, is still available, possibly if you were lucky out on some of the, um, some of the raffles today. And then Toby, given his opinion, he thinks they're great also. So they are all Toby approved, which is very important. No shoe is a good shoe unless it's Toby approved. All right, again, that's three minutes of a quick shoe review of three different shoes. So a minute of shoes, not too bad. And I'll talk to you next time. Alrighty, follow me, um, Nadudon on Instagram. I'd appreciate it. Thank you, bye.